Alright everyone, hello and welcome to Expand 2 by Mr. Moose. You can see him rotating right here, it's pretty cool. We played Expand 1 quite a while ago now actually, it was a, a few months or a couple at least, I don't know, it was, it was quite a while ago, but yeah, it was really fun. Uh, so yeah, I thought I'd, I'd do the second one. We have a button in, in our inventory which we place on this thing to start the thing, but I want to quickly point out, there's thank you Stemister. Now I assume this is, you know, a detect the player name and just insert it onto the sign, but that's pretty cool. Thank you. You're welcome, Mr. Moose. I didn't really do anything, but you're welcome. And yeah, this is all just rules and info, and let's just get started. So, if you didn't watch the first episode, it's pretty. It's a really cool concept, actually. You start in this little world border. Right now, it's a one by one. But as soon as we solve the puzzle, which you know is by doing this, we can break chest. Uh, ship comes in high fate and nether gold ore. We break this chest. I'm sure. I'm. I'm sure we'll get some items out of it. There we go, that's a lot of wool. Uh, but yeah, as soon as we, you know, complete the puzzle in this little area, the board bottle will expand and we will unlock more puzzles. So what can we do with this? We can play some blue wool and pink, blah blah blah. Uh, can it be placed on like a, a dropper, is this? A dispenser, can it be placed on a dispenser? Orange, purple, red, red concrete powder, where's that? Maybe that's something we find later. Can I just press this button? I cannot. What else can I break with this? I can break the stripped crimson hyphae and never gold ore. Hmm, I don't know what else to do though. There is a hint book, and I'm pretty sure the first page doesn't actually have a hint on it. I can actually open it. I'm right clicking. Oh, there we go. This is the hint book. It will give you hints about the uh, current puzzle you are on. Hints are not needed to solve puzzles in other words. You do not need to open this book to complete the map. But yeah, the second page will actually have a hint on it, so I'm not going to look at the second page. At least not just yet. But... Where do I actually start with this chain of wools? It looks like with the red one, right? No, with the purple one. Can we put some red concrete powder, but... There's no red concrete powder around me. And I can't break that because it's outside the world border, so it's something in this little one by one that I need to do. Nothing in my hidden in my inventory. I broke the chest. Yeah, I don't know what else to do. Should I just use the hint book, I guess? I guess I will. Uh, walk the hints one to three will give you basic hints about the puzzle. The walkthrough will provide a step-by-step -step solution to the puzzle. Uh, hint one, look with you. Got the chest. The chest may be locked, but you can still break it. I, I broke it. Chest hint three, don't overthink the order those items should go in. Oh, in the dropper. Oh. I... Dispenser. I didn't think about putting them in this thing. I just... Uh, yeah, okay. I don't... Yeah, is it don't th overthink the order, but do I want to, you know... This can go on red wool, this can go on, you know, light blue, and then green. Is is Do I have to do this? I don't know. Probably not. Oh, that's lime. Oops, so... I, I'm just making sure. It said don't overthink, but I'm just making sure. And then blue, and then pink, and then green, and then that. Or maybe it's not that. Maybe it's a uh, rainbow order? We'll see. Red, orange, yellow, green, dark green, uh, light blue, indigo, violet. Maybe switch those around. Nope. I guess it's not that. Uh, huh. I don't know what this is, actually. Wait, did I... Did I do... When, what? Did I even put pink in there? Pink goes first, right? Because it's like... It wouldn't go like that. Red... Yeah, it wouldn't go like that. It would be pink, red, orange, yellow... Green, blue... Oh yeah, I put pink last. Oh, yep, okay, that worked though. Pink was first. I, I forgot where I put pink, and for some reason I put it at the end. That, yeah, doesn't really make sense. Well... I don't know. Anyway, we unlock that. What do we do now? We've got three different buttons. What do these do? I have no idea. What if we press all of them at the same time? Oh, that one's really quick. That one's... Kind of slow, and this one's... Also kind of slow, so same time. Nothing. This one? This one? No. Uh, so... I mean, we know this is going to be cra uh, placed on... Uh, where is it? Red. Red concrete powder, and then we can make a chain of it. We can't break that yet. Ah, uh, so it is, is it this? CWCWW? Maybe crimson warped, crimson warped, warped? I don't know what the glass one's for, but crimson I think is this one. Gotta be right. Yeah, and then warped a sizzle. Crimson, warped, crimson, warped, 
swapped. Finish? Or is that reset? So crimson warped, maybe. Crimson warped. Waiting for the button to come back up. Warped. Okay, yeah, this one was a reset button. I see. And now we can break this thing and hopefully find something underneath it. No, but we did get three gold nuggets. Okay, sure. Now what? Now can we reach that thing? No, we can reach that though. There we go, we've got a bow with probably infinity, an arrow and a netherite ingot. Okay, so what do we want to shoot? Two, that says. Oh, hello. That's... He has to really look high, and that was that was just it. Okay, cool. So now we've got access to this thing. Three ladders, okay. Maybe this is saying only use two ladders, because we can only use two ladders. Like, if we do that, we can, you know, keep one. Spare. Or something else. That's probably what that two means. I hope it is. Because if it's not, I'm probably going to forget about it, and it's going to mean something really late into the into the map. And yeah, I'm going to probably forget about it. But I don't know what that is. I feel like I can take all of these out now and just hold on to them for a little bit. And then once we find that red concrete powder, we can snake the blocks around uh, for whatever reason we need. Click uh, click me if you messed up the chest placement. Oh, okay. Give me steak. Okay. Gold input. Oh, do we need to craft one, or is it just... Is it just this? The nuggets. It looks like we do need to craft it, so... Is there a crafting table around, maybe? I, I don't remember seeing one. I, 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 I don't see one at all. Above, maybe? Hmm, there's a chest. Hello, villager. If the trade is unavailable, check back later. Fair enough. I, I don't know where this crafting table is, if I even need it at all, but it won't let me just deposit those. So... Can I just craft in my invent? No. I don't know, maybe there's something unique about this map which let you do that. I don't know. Ah. Huh. Where is this crafting table? Am I blind? There is a custom resource pack, so... It's possible... It's a, you know, a retextured block? I don't know. It's not that thing. Hmm. Yeah, I really don't see it. Maybe I should use this hint again. My cat is scratching up. Well, one of my cats is scratching up my door to get out. Okay, let's use this thing. Uh, yep, hint one, two, three. You're able to get out of the hole now. Yep, okay. Each nether gold ore you mine will give you three gold nuggets. There are three nether gold ore you are currently, mine, currently able to mine. Uh, you need to throw, the, throw an item in a hopper. Yes, I know. Uh, place a ladder there, use the wooden pickaxe to mine. Uh, place three ladders on the strip, so it, it does expect me, to, expect me to use all three, but I, I saved one, which is, which is fine. Uh, using the wooden pickaxe to mine the top stripped cr- I wish I realised that, I, oh, I shouldn't have needed the hint book for that. Of course this is the answer. And then I can craft it, yeah. Of course that's the answer. Why did I... I I shouldn't have looked at the hint book. I'm so bad at this. Ugh. That was such a simple thing that I should have realised. Anyway. What did that unlock? The chest probably, right? Yeah, it unlocked this chest. Okay. There we go. We got some vine seeds. I don't know what they can be planted on. There's... Uh, like there's carpets around. I think those are just for light sources or something. Oh, this thing? There we go. Can I pick them up? I cannot. But that lets me get all the way up there, which is pretty cool. My hair is falling in my face and it's making me itchy. Okay, but now that we're up here, what what do we... What do we unlock from this? Find the button. Well, that was easy. I, I like that find the button map. Very simple. Hello, cow. How are you doing? I, I can't I can't get to you yet, but I, I know I can now mine never mind. I was gonna say I can mine even more gold ore, oh, but yeah this one, but I my pickaxe broke, so I can't do that. Standing here doesn't really seem to do anything just yet. I'm gonna keep this ladder, even though I probably don't really need to at all. Uh but I'll keep it. I can't access that chest. Oh. There's a wool down there. Like blue wool. I have no idea what it's for. 
I still have this netherite ingot. Maybe that's for a trade with the, the boy. Boy up there. Go straight up, not to the sides. Oh, that's that's the, the wool where I place the wool. That's a red cocoa powder. Okay, sure. But what else do I do? I can't give him steak yet because, you know, I can't get the cow. Oh, wait, I can go in here. Can I go high? Oh! I'm, I'm blind. Carpet breaker. At least we found it, though. At least we got it. Okay, so we'll, we'll just break all the carpet. I'm sure we don't need to break that one, but I'll just go around and break all of them. Okay, that leads to something. We'll check it out in a second. But first, this one. Redstone block. Okay. Let's, let's go down here. And just before I do this, just before I get to the bottom, I'm going to let my cat out. All right, we are down. What is in here? Stone axe can break warped stem. Okay. And ancient debris. We're getting a, going to be getting a lot of netherite. So I guess we need to come back down here later when we can break iron bars. But now, the warped stem, was it? Warped stem, yes. I believe it was up here, right? On the floor, I think? Or is it this thing? Oh, it's this thing. Okay. Oh. What was I supposed to break those? Oh, no. Uh. I might have messed up. I mean, I've got the warped planks, but what... What can I do with eight planks? A chest? Why would I want to make a chest? I, 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 I do make a chest. Can be placed on crimson nylium. Uh, what, what is that? Crimson nylium. I don't know what that is. I don't know what block that is. That's a new block. 1.16 block. Uh, this thing? Nope, that's... Hmm... I mean, it's red, right? It's like this thing? No. Where is it? Oh, I see. It's here. It says, click me if you messed up the chest placement. Do I just place it like that? Oh, and then I can access... Of course. Okay. Cool. We've got a key. And we place some red wool. Red wool, red wool. Where do I remember seeing red, red wool? Do I remember seeing red wool? Uh... I don't at all. I only remember red carpet. Have I seen red wool yet? Is it above me, maybe? Like, huh. There's red carpet over there. I see that. I mean, yeah, there's red wool here in my infantry, but I can't do anything with that yet. Maybe, maybe it's just down here? I know there's a nether brick down here. Like, it's a chiseled nether brick or something. But yeah, red wool, I don't remember. And it's not in there. Hmm. Maybe there's a carpet I need to break that I'm missing. Is, have I not broken a carpet? I mean, this is blue wool. If it could be placed on that, that would be perfect, but no. That's that's definitely like light blue wool. Red wool, I don't... Oh, where? I haven't seen this at all, I don't think. I just... I looked in here, and then I just went like that. And there's a, there's things in, in the lava. I, I can't say words. Wow, okay. That was lucky. So, I guess we make a furnace of this. I'm just gonna make sure. Yeah, okay, furnace. And another scrap before they, you know, smelt the netherite scrap into. No, smelt the ancient debris into netherite scrap. Maybe. Can we place on chiseled nether bricks? We know where that is. We know exactly where that is. So, yeah, it was just luck in the lava, I guess, to make progress, and there's no actual red wool just yet. But what do we. What do we. What do we do with this? What, like, what do I smell? Um. The ladder? I don't think I was supposed to, but maybe? I have two netherite ingots now. Sure. I can't, yeah, I can't smell those. Uh, I don't know if I, I did that right. I might have done that very, very wrong. Hint book, of course. I, I'm lost. What do I do? There's a sugar box that blends in with the ground, hidden somewhere. I imagine that's the blue one. I craft a chest to place some, that's something that looks like wool. Maybe carpet. The blue one. It's blue carpet, and then there's red wool underneath it. I'm a genius. I did think that was carpet. I, I did. I know I kept calling it wool, but I did think it was carpet. The only reason I said it wasn't carpet is because I was. I, I don't know actually, but yeah. I, I. The reason I didn't try to break it is because I forgot I could break carpet, and when I you know realized I could break carpet, I already convinced myself that that was wool. Um, so, I don't know. 
But anyway, we have this thing, which is... There's a button for it down here, right? But I can't access it yet? Yeah, there's that. I don't know what that's going to do yet. Did we unlock the powder yet? No, that's miles away. So what did we unlock here? The cow? Oh, okay, yeah, we've got to unlock this steak guy. So maybe we need to kill the cow somehow, but we can't reach the cow, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, not just yet. What's that say? One. Hmm. I still think I... Glowstone. I still think, yeah, using that ladder to smelt the, the netherite thing wasn't the right thing to do. I was probably supposed to use that thing. Whoops, that's fine. It shouldn't break the map too much, I don't think. But yeah, if we make this jump now... I can kill him. Okay, okay, and then we can cook the beef with the charcoal. Okay, this works perfectly fine. Now we get the steak from this, and I'm sure it doesn't really matter too much because you can just, you know, throw in the ancient debris now anyway if you wanted to. It doesn't really matter that I used a ladder instead of a charcoal. I would have just got it then anyway, so yeah, it, it should be fine. Hi, you want this thing? Wow, okay. Rocket man. There we go. He's gone. Now, we have these things. Oh, yeah, the button, of course. Does, is it, like, opening the thing down here? No, it's something else. Itchy nose. What is that doing? Ah, this might take a while to figure out. Maybe it's opening this? Oh wait, orange glass. Oh! It's- oh, it's just showing me where the barrel is. That's all it was doing. It was just showing me where the barrel was. That's literally all that is. But I already got the barrel, so... It, it didn't matter. Yeah, ancient debris. And what else was in there? Um, scrap, I think. The three scrap. I, I got it. What else am I supposed to do with that? Um, I can't mine gold to, you know, make an, a third one with this netherite scrap. And I need one more netherite scrap anyway. Um, so... I don't know what to do. I need to either break the iron bars or do something else. Oh! How, how long was that there? I don't know. Hopefully not too long. There we go. Oh, we have got a third one. Okay, uh, are we just making a netherite block to finish or something? Is that what the fight finale is? Can break iron bars. There we go. And this will unlock a lot more buttons, which... If it does the same thing as this, that's... We know exactly what to do, just press the button and run to them as fast as possible. Um, but I guess we'll see. The time's ticking up. And now this is slime. Which gives me jumpers as well. Okay! Ah. But the, the time for it is ticking up, so one... Two, three. Lanterns below the bridge. Hint, I only work on certain items, only put in one at a time. Three. So if we know where all the... Oh, wait. Okay, so this one says two. So this one's two. But... Huh? We know where all the signs are. Alright, two is down here. Wait, the lowest is two, so... Oh, I'm confused. And then there's one here that says one or something. Where was this one? I can't remember. can't remember which where the signs were. And obviously the third one's up there. Where was the second sign that, which said one? Oh, I, I think I remember where it was. Um... It's like here or something? Up there? No. Where was it? There, I see. So two is the lowest, one is the middle, three is the highest. Does that does that mean the order is two, one, three? I could try it. Nope. Two, one, three. Three, one, two. 
I, I just pressed buttons and it worked. I don't know what the actual order was. It worked though. But now I've realized there's a whole lot of carpets that I've not broken. Like there's the brown one up there. That actually might be it. That might maybe it. But there's, there's also the other buttons that I've not pressed. The yellow one and the blue one. So let's press those and see what happens. Blue. Oh, it's one thing at a time. Get it, time, haha. So yeah, the, the green deactivated now. So where's the blue one? I don't remember seeing the blue one. Uh, a blue concrete thing. Obviously the yellow one's there. I'm going to use the jump boost. Oh, I don't have it anymore, of course. Ah, that's unfortunate. <clears throat> so where's this, this blue activating thing? What did that activate for me? Maybe I've not unlocked it yet. There's also a yellow thing there. Hmm... Maybe the, yeah, the blue thing isn't available yet. Possible. Also, the lanterns have disappeared. Huh. Let's press the yellow one. Because we know there's definitely a yellow block we can use. Or at least do something with. I don't know. Does this have any other use? Iron bars now, okay. But this thing now, what? You're an anvil. Okay. I don't know what that means for us, I don't know why that's good. But we know it's there, so if we go back to the green one, we can get up to that brown carpet, break that thing and hope there's something under there. Maybe? Big jump. Yeah, I mean, obviously nothing under there, so... Let's see the block that's under it, so... Can I maybe make it anywhere from this bridge? Hmm... I may be stuck. I I I'm not sure. Can I jump down here? Does this have anything interesting? No. I feel like I'm missing something obvious again. Is it just hidden in the corner somewhere? I don't know. Oh, there's a blue thing. I see. I mean, we can press the button and see what that blue thing opens. At least, at least, what it leads to, maybe. Maybe it leads to like something, a big corridor that I can't see down, I don't really know. But I can get back up there, right? Yeah, just do this thing. Should be fine. Oh, hit my head. And... Yeah, I can't really see down there. Oh, it's iron bars! Okay, so we, we know we can break those. That's fine, when we actually unlock it. Hmm... I, I might need to use the hint for this, honestly. So I'm kind of lost right now. But I'm actually going to leave this episode here. And we'll carry this on in the next episode. Oh, this is, this is, I mean, really good, but difficult. At some parts, especially. But yeah, that's going to be it. 22 minutes, 23 minutes, actually. If you like, be sure to like. If you really like, don't see more like this, be sure to subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Thanks so much for watching. And see ya.